Welcome to this episode of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. We're out here today on Lake Huron. We're going to be flying the Spark here, so uh, we're just going to take it up over the lake. There's some uh, a ship coming up a uh, lake down there, so uh, we're going to see if we can capture some video. So uh, we've already checked hover and everything. We're clear to fly. Uh, we've got satellites. Just looking, I've got 14. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take this up. Kind of let it set in a minute or so. And let it get... And... I'm going to clear this. And I'm going to start the video. Okay, space full. So video is recording. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and take this up and out. Now I'm just going to take it out a little bit. And uh, I want to pan it around a little bit and uh, take it up a little bit more. And uh, we should be getting the ship. We got a little bit of breeze coming in off the lake, so I don't want to get out there too far. And uh, I'm trying to see, I don't really see the ship on the. Let me yaw back this way. You do a bit of yaw. So there, that, there's looking down the coastline, if you will, or the shoreline. And then let's uh, rotate it back out this way. I want to see something here. Uh, let's see. Uh, I got a little clouds in the sky. And we'll take it up. There's the shoreline looking up a bit. So we're just hanging out up, up there. I don't know if you can see it. Just a beautiful day. Just kind of taking a flight out over the lake. Just kind of, just kind of checking things out. We got the ship out there. Ship's out there quite a quite a ways. So that ship's about two miles out. So let's uh, let's head out that way a little bit more. And you say we got a lot of seagulls out here today. I just want to just double check my battery as I'm flying out that way because getting out over the lake quite a ways. <clears throat> and we'll see how far. So we're at about 80 meters, 90. I take it up a little bit more. And we're getting out there about 114, 115. We're just pushing it. I'm going to bring it back over, back, yacht back towards, I think, the ship. And uh, we're just kind of heading it back out. Still got it, heading it out over the lake. We're out there quite a ways. I think this is probably about the furthest I've had the, uh, the spark. And uh, we're still pretty, holding pretty good on signal. Still got a pretty good battery. We're out about 200 meters, 600 feet. So I want to see, maybe hit up around a thousand feet or so, and see how it is. Uh, battery's still looking good. If we get too tight, we can bring it back via sport mode. So we're still heading out there, and. We're closing on about 300 meters, and so we're at about 300 meters. I want to yaw down. There's what the water looks like beneath me, and I'm just going to yaw it back up, and that's what it looks like on the horizon. So I'm now going to start just reversing my path, and... Uh, Actually, I'm just I'm just sticking it right straight back because I want to get that uh, sort of look out at the lake rather than kind of looking at myself. And uh, I want to yaw it up a little bit back this way. That's going to angle it a little bit back towards me. And, uh, oh, I can still see it out there quite a bit. It's it's coming back in uh, pretty good. I don't know if you can, you probably can't see it on the hat cam. But uh, 
I'm at almost 200 meters and I can actually see it in the sky. I'm actually a little bit blown away by that fact. So again, I'm bringing it right straight back backwards. Yeah, I've got the gimbal kind of gimbal down a little bit. And so here we're coming back towards us. We still got actually pretty good battery left. Uh, but I just kind of want to be a little bit careful because I got a little bit of wind here. And uh, I don't want to lose it out over the lake. So uh, just bringing it back. I don't know if you can see it up there. I'm now at about, you know, under 100 meters. And so definitely, well, easy sight. I, I'm just blown away. I could see that at almost 200 meters out there, the spark. And so we're, we got it up there. And so we're, we're now pretty close in. So uh, I'm going to bring it back. I still got some pretty good battery. I'm going to do a little bit of yaw with it and kind of take a look around. And so there's the shoreline going up that we're taking a look at. And uh, let's gimbal it down a little bit. You can kind of see the the water beneath us. I want to gimbal it. Oh, check this out. This is kind of neat video. Check the water out as I spin it around. Here you go, Norbert. This is a little bit of yaw party for you, buddy. I haven't done a yaw party in a while. Look at that. That is really funky looking. Um, I want to actually try... I want to back it up towards me a little bit more. That's, I want to keep it away from those trees over there, but I want to I want to try to bring it back this way a little bit more. And we're bringing it back a little bit more, and I want to just bring it back. So I'm getting a bit of the beach, and so what I want to do is, that's what I want to do. Now that's uh, that's some interesting video right there, folks. And we're just kind of spinning it around. Just gonna get some video footage. I think that's I think that's actually kind of cool. Uh, we still got uh, pretty good battery left, so I want to bring it down a little bit more, and uh, I want to try something. So I'm going to bring it back Oh, it must be facing towards me So I'm bringing it back over top of me And I'm down here, so I want to yaw it back around But uh, I want to bring it down a little bit more. And uh, I want to back it out. And then what I want to do is I want to take it forward. And we're taking it out. And we're taking it out. We're taking it out. And... We got some video of that, which is actually working out pretty good. Stand behind me, Brock, please. Uh, my grandson just told me we found a way to the beach. Well, I think we found a way to the beach, too. So, anyways, uh, we're getting a little bit down there from the home point. So, I'm going to do one more run out there. Again, I got the cam camera gimbal down, and what I'm going to do is do some shots with it. Kind of going out and looking down as I punch it out over the lake. And you just kind of see it down that path. There's the path to the lake. <clears throat> and we got the waves. And now we're just kind of heading out over the lake with the waves. And we're just kind of keeping it going. And we're just going to bring it. Well, let's, let's do a little quick yaw party as an addition. And I'm going to bring it back around. And then we're going to. We're going to bring it just straight on back, and then we're going to land it, because we're going to probably be pretty close to low battery. We're going to bring it back. Okay. And there we are. 
So we're going to save out the video and we're going to bring it down a little bit. Just kind of take a look. And we still got the ship out there. We got this spark here. So things are looking pretty good. Um, so we're going to just set her down now. I'm just going to take her on the grass. We have the landing gear on it. And we're just going to set it straight down. And there we go. So we've uh, another great flight of the spark. So we have another great flight of the spark over Lake Huron. We got a ship out there. So uh, anyways, you know the routine. I don't know what's for lunch today. I had a foot-long hot dog for dinner, so that's great. Uh, I'll think about lunch tomorrow. And hey, don't forget the subscribe button uh, over there and comment down below. And we'll see you in the next video. Cheers.